Pleased to say she's here with us now in the studio. Lily, great to have you on board. So how's it all going? Oh, I've had such a great first few days. It's been, been quite busy, but so much fun. And I'm so excited, so excited that I'm the new weather presenter here, especially in the Channel Islands. I just think we're so lucky, aren't we, with the amazing scenery, unique weather patterns as well. So can't wait to get yeah. stuck in. Am I definitely not new to the Channel Islands? No, I am a local. I was born in Jersey. And a fun fact you might not know, I was actually named after two Jersey cows. <laughs> Farm, can you believe? So can't really get that much more local than that, can oh, you? They are beautiful. So, They're you know, lovely. I'm not really not? sure if that's a compliment or not. <laughs> yes, it is. It is a compliment. Now, uh, let's talk about the weather because we've had yet another gloomy day. Where's the sun gone? It has been so gloomy, so great. Quite similar, actually, to what we've been having the past few days. This one was sent in by another Lil, actually, uh, from St Peter's Valley earlier in the week. Plenty of cloud cover there, and I'm afraid if you prefer the brighter and the sunnier weather, well, actually, we've got some more rain and some more fog on the way. So let's get the full details now in your forecast. Well, Lily, I don't like the rain, but at least you are bringing us some sunshine oh, with that lovely smile. Uh, that is it from us. Alex is back at 10.30. Yes, yes that's right. See you and, then. Uh, yeah, we'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good night. So, yes, it has been a dry day for most of us, but still the grey and overcast weather story continues. Thank you, Elizabeth, for sending this one in at the gun site today in Jersey. That grey, murky cloud overhead. And I'm afraid if you prefer the brighter weather, well, it's not looking to improve that much with fog actually arriving tomorrow. Could even cause a bit of travel disruption, so do keep an eye out if you've got any plans to get away. As well, it's been biting in those winds today, and they will whip up again overnight before calming down tomorrow morning. But it is turning wetter as well with the arrival of some rain. So back to tonight then, we start things off dry and overcast before this band of rain swoops southwards. And you can see from the brighter colours on the chart there that that rain will be quite heavy and quite persistent at times. So don't be surprised if it wakes you up rattling on your window panes or on your roofs. Temperatures though, feeling pretty mild at 10 degrees. So actually, that's more like a daytime temperature for this time of year. As we head into tomorrow, that band of rain lingers first thing, could be a little bit damp in the morning rush hour, but then clearing to more drizzle and patchy rain, though the fog does settle in. It is expected to be worse as well in Jersey. The fog could clear for a time in Guernsey and Alderney. And temperatures just a notch up on today, sitting at 12 degrees across our islands. So let's get our times now of high water between around 4 a.m. in the morning and 5 a.m. and then again at 4.30 and 5.30 in the evening. Sea temperature just above 9 degrees. So as we take a look at the wider picture midweek, we can see that as one weather system moves away, hot on its heels is this one here, bringing again more rain, a bit of a repeat situation on Wednesday night with those damp conditions. So it is unsurprising that Thursday brings another grey and another wet day, those winds right up as well to a 4-6. But by the weekend, there will be a little bit of sunshine to compensate for the cloud and rain, and it is turning cooler as well. Take care. Hello there, good afternoon. Well, it's feeling biting today in those strong winds and the grey weather story continues as well. This was a scene captured at St Peter's Valley by Lille yesterday. Those clouds looking quite dramatic overhead and we will see more of that grey weather today and over the next few days. Could produce the odd spot of drizzle here and there and temperatures, they are mild, but in those winds up to a force five and force six is going to feel even cooler, especially in the likes of Alderney. Now, as we leave today, heading into tonight, it will be overcast first thing, those winds whipping up even more before this weather front sweeps southwards towards our islands, bringing some more heavy and persistent rain. You could even hear that on your roofs overnight and temperatures still mild, 10 degrees across our islands. So tomorrow morning, that rain lingers first thing, fairly heavy to start with, clearing to leave behind some mist and fog. So do check if you're planning on traveling and temperatures similar to today. Take care. Hello there, very good morning. Well, it is a damp start today in the morning rush hour before that rain clears away to give way to some drizzle and patchy outbreaks of rain. That fog settling in as well, expected to be worse in Jersey and could even cause some travel disruption. Temperatures still mild for the time of year, just above average at 12 degrees.